Hello internet, welcome to my first real, like, official YouTube video. It's taking me forever, you know, long story short, taking me forever to finally, like, get started with this, but today in the mail I got my first fortune cookie soap box, which I am really excited about, and I just almost dropped it. Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> um, I don't know if you can tell, but the box got, like, severely damaged in the mail. This part right here. Can you see? This part right here? This part was like pushed like in really far like that and I popped it back out when I opened it but I was really scared this whole thing was going to be damaged and this is the first one that I got so I didn't want it to be damaged. I mean I never wanted it to be damaged but yeah so a little bit of it got damaged which you know it's unfortunate but at least the majority of it is intact and the fortune cookie soap itself is intact and uh, it's just one of the items got damaged unfortunately so. I think my post office is just very incompetent because they tried to deliver another box that I was supposed to get and I didn't get it. They didn't leave the little notice for me and I'm like, what, what is going on here? So, we're just going to breathe and go with it anyway. Um, so anyway, I'm going to unbox this and I did already open it like I said because the box was damaged and I wanted to see if anything inside was damaged. Um, so I already know, like, I already know what I got, but I'm going to read on the card what I got and smell it, I guess. Um, I do have a blog and I will be putting, you know, more detailed information on the blog post and I'll post, like, pictures of the actual products and if I have a review after I've used it, I'll post it there. I won't necessarily make a video for all that, but, um, unboxing videos are some of my favorite videos to watch, so I wanted to make my own. So let me get started here. The first item that I have is actually unmarked and I think they just they forgot to put a label on it because according to the little card that came with it, um, it's supposed to have a label. <laughs> um, so I'm not really, I think this is what it is. It's supposed to be cuticle butter and it's supposed to smell like rich cream egg and a touch of nutmeg and man, it's pretty strong. <laughs> Yeah, it smells like eggnog. Yeah, it smells like eggnog, I think. Um, yeah, it feels like a really, like a really rich cream and, you know, which works for like eggnog, I guess, but yeah, just use a little bit at a time. It smells good, I like it, just not, I don't recommend sticking your nose in it like I did. Um, but yeah, so this is supposed to be um, loose mug cuticle butter, which this, I guess this whole theme, like this old-fashioned family Christmas theme. I think that's supposed to be from a movie, but I don't know what movie because, I mean, by read, just reading this card, it looks to me like it's a movie in poor taste, which means I would absolutely hate it. So I'm glad I don't know what this is from. Uh, most people probably know what it's from. I don't. Um, anyway. Okay, so uh, these names are so weird. I don't, because uh, I haven't seen the movie. I don't get it. I don't want to get it. I don't want to know. Anyway, this is a whipped soap. Ooh. I don't know if you can, that light might be too bright for anything to show up, but I mean this is white in color and it's just, it's a whipped soap, which I'm not really, I guess it's like, you can use it as a hand soap or a body soap probably, but yeah, it smells really good. I like this one. This is supposed to smell like juicy plum and whipped caramel wrapped in artisan bourbon vanilla and jasmine blossoms. That's pretty accurate. I think that's what it smells like. It smells pretty good. This next one is Jello Surprise. This is a whipped cream and it's a little bit like green, green tinted. I don't know if that's going to show up with that bright light right there, but it's very, very lightly green tinted. Mm. What am I smelling? What is this? A uh, festive plum with a zesty curl of citrus all wrapped up pretty like with wintered or orchard <laughs> winter orchid and soft sandalwood. Yeah, this one's really good. I like this one too. Okay, this one is the hand sanitizer and it is not even gonna try to pronounce that. Um it's tropical spiced rum. Tahitian vanilla sprinkled with jasmine petals and twisted woods. This is probably just going to smell like alcohol because it's hand sanitizer. Yep. <laughs> I think in small doses this would smell really good. 
but yeah, just smelling hand sanitizers up close like that does not, do not recommend. Okay, this next thing is a little foil wrapped, which I think is, yeah, it's a shower steamer, and it's supposed to be a brisk and outdoorsy blend of blue spruce and balls balsam for fresh mint and garden herbs. Oh, that's really strong. It doesn't smell bad. It just it's really strong. It kind of smells like uh, kind of smells like that big vapor rub stuff because it's like clearing my sinuses out, which is a good thing. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so I don't really know how you use these. I guess you just put it in the shower <laughs> while you're taking a shower, and it like fills with nice smells. I don't know. I don't take showers. I take baths. So this is the part. Oh, we have a whatever that is. Um, this is the part that got damaged for me. It's like completely smashed. I don't know if you can... It's it's pretty smashed. <laughs> I think this is supposed to be like a solid lotion bar. It's a, it's called a Hydrate Me. It says scrumptious vanilla pumpkin waffles topped with brown sugar, pecans, and sheets of fresh whipped cream. Okay, this is probably not gonna... Oh no, uh-uh. No, no, no. Ooh, no. <laughs> this smells just the only thing I can smell when I smell this is pecans, and I'm super allergic to pecans, so that's probably why I don't like the smell. Um, I don't even know if I can use that because pecans and allergic, so I don't know if that'll work out, but um, I might pass that along to my mom or somebody else who likes like nutty smells. If you like nutty smells, you're probably really gonna like that, but if you're <laughs> allergic to nuts like me, it just, I don't know, all I can smell is pecan, even though there's other things mixed in there. That's like the overpowering smell for me, so I don't think I'll be using that, plus I might be allergic to it, so. This next thing is... This doesn't have a label either. Is it supposed to have a label? No, okay, no, this one's not supposed to have a label, so it's the Mystery Scent. It's the Christmas Bonus Deep Conditioner. Third Annual Mystery Fragrance. Um, yeah. So you're supposed to guess what it smells like, and you can enter to win a $50 gift card. Okay, well. Oh my gosh. I have no idea what this smells like. <laughs> no idea whatsoever. Oh my gosh. I, I have no idea. Okay, no. I have no idea. It smells good. But I can't even begin to comprehend what mixture that is in order to, like, guess it and enter the contest, but yeah. If you got this box and you have any idea of what this smells like, like let me know in the comments. Like I won't send it in. Like you send it in and then let me know because I want to know what this smells like. I don't know. Okay. And last but not least, we have the fortune cookie soap. This is the part I was looking forward to the most because it's soap in the shape of a fortune cookie. Um, it's red, so it fits with you know, the Christmas theme and. Ooh. Ooh, that smells really good. I like this one. What is this? What am I smelling? Okay, um, a hint of sweet almond with warm swirls of tobacco. Really? I don't like the smell of tobacco, and I don't like almonds either, because up until a few months ago, I thought I was allergic to almonds, too. I don't smell almond, and I don't smell tobacco. <laughs> I don't know, but it smells good, so I don't really care. Yeah, anyway. Oh, I already pulled the fortune out of it. I couldn't wait for the video. Um, but yeah, I guess this is something from the movie too because I have no idea what this means. It says, Would it be indecent to ask the grandparents to stay at a hotel? No idea. Totally just do not know what that means. But anyway, overall, I am. <clears throat> excuse me. Overall, <laughs> bad day to film a video. Um, I'm really, you know, interested to see like using these products I want to see you know, which ones I like which ones I don't like like I said I don't think I'll be using the pecan one because I'm scared to. <laughs> but everything else smells pretty good it's, you know some of it's kind of strong but when you get it out and use it I'm sure it's not gonna be that strong so um, I am looking forward to using that especially the fortune cookie shaped soap um, I'm also gonna use you know my little ten dollar gift card thing that you get with every box and I'm gonna go buy some other fortune cookie shaped soaps because who doesn't want fortune cookie shaped soap okay anyway I have like three more videos to film while I have this little weird setup going on so I'm gonna go do that 
And um, yeah, first unboxing video. I'm sorry it was so weird. I don't know what I'm doing yet, so just <laughs> bear with me. Um, thanks for watching, and you can always check out my blog at beautycleric.com for more information. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. All those links will be down below. Thanks for watching.